What's going on, everybody? What is going on, everybody? It is your boy, Darion, coming to you live with another video. It is the Spotlight Sports Talk. Shout out to all the subscribers that have subscribed to the YouTube page. And this is your first time ever being at our YouTube page. I would suggest that you subscribe and hit that bell button and get the latest news in all sports. But I see that everybody wants to make the YouTube um, video about what happened last night on Thursday Night Football. Um, a lot of things went down on Thursday Night Football, especially the brawl. Now, what I've seen, knowing that I was live streaming last night for this game, um, a lot of people didn't come in the chat, but that's besides the point. Um, the, the, the point is, is this, that um, what happened in Thursday Night Football was definitely unprofessional. Unprofessional um, on, from both sides, in my in my opinion. Um I'm not taking, like I said in this video, I'm not taking the Brown side. I'm not taking the Pittsburgh Steelers side. I'm taking it from my perspective and my opinion on this situation. Um, so please subscribe to the channel. Hit the like button. And um, just let me know what y'all think. And just let me know what y'all think. Uh, so let's get straight into it. So I have watched this video so many times this morning. I have watched it so many times going into this last night. Um, Twitter went off last night because what I've said on Twitter about Mason Rudolph starting it, um, from my perspective and how I see how this, how this went down, I felt like Mason Rudolph started this. Yes, I understand that Miles Garrett uh, tackled him without the football being in his hands, but the tackle wasn't severe to a point where Mason Rudolph was trying to rip his helmet off of his. Now, if you look at the video from the beginning, don't look at it from when Miles Garrett ripped his helmet off and then hit him over the head with it, because that's not the full story. Now, the full story is, is what happened is that, okay, yes, Miles Garrett took him down without the football. That's absolutely wrong. But there was no flag thrown at the same time. Then you see Miles Garrett's arms wrapped around Mason Rudolph. And Mason Rudolph took him down. I mean, I'm Mason Rudolph. Uh, Miles Garrett took you down, and there Mason Rudolph is hit is, is is pushing his head down one, and then two is trying to rip his head off this way. So I'm like, okay, why did we all want to know why did Miles Garrett go the way he went off? And I think he was triggered by that. He was, something was said. This is just my opinion. Something was said, or something happened within that instance to make Miles Garrett go off. Am I saying Miles Garrett wrong? Yes, he is wrong for ripping off Mason Rudolph's helmet. But is Mason Rudolph wrong? Yes, both of these parties are wrong. You started ripping off his helmet and the reaction came that Miles Garrett ended up ripping your helmet off. And then once he ripped the helmet off, I don't know if y'all really see this in slow motion, but once he ripped the helmet off of Mason Rudolph, you had an offensive lineman from the Pittsburgh Steelers hold Miles Garrett back. Mason Rudolph gets up. He uh, tried to attack Miles Garrett, and that's where over the helmet hits. Do I feel like he should have did that? No. I feel like none of these people should have did none of that. I'm not defending any of it, but all I need to say to the NFL is that the NFL needs to suspend everyone, not just Miles Garrett. And I've been saying this on my YouTube channel, and I've said it in my live stream, i said it on Twitter. I'm, all I'm saying is, is that both parties should be suspended. Mason Rudolph started it, Miles Garrett finished it. At the end of the day, Pouncey should be suspended. Both people, both teams that was involved in the part, involved in this brawl, should be suspended. I understand my, what Miles Garrett did should be suspended for the end of the year. I agree with that. But do you think if Miles Garrett didn't actually throw the throw the foot throw the helmet at like swing the helmet at Mason Rudolph, I don't think the suspension would have been a year. But since he did that, he's going to be suspended for a year. People saying, "Oh, he should be in jail. It's an assault." Y'all taking it too far. Y'all taking it too far. At the end of the day, Mason Rudolph started it. Miles Garrett finished it, and then all parties involved. That was in the brawl should be suspended. That's just my personal opinion. I mean, Miles, what Miles Garrett did was absolutely wrong. It's absolutely wrong. I'm not defending him at all. But at the same time, 
if you want to suspend someone, suspend everybody. That's all I'm saying. Suspend everybody. And the NFL needs to take toll of that. You can't look at it just from one angle. And I feel like the NFL is going to take it as one angle. They're going after Miles Garrett, but not going to go after Mason Rudolph. But that is um, something that I just wanted to get off my chest as far as how that whole brawl went out. Comment, like, and subscribe to the channel. It is a Spotlight Sports Talk. And I'll see y'all live tonight, Sixers versus Thunder. Uh, I will be on there on YouTube. So I'll see y'all later. Peace.